Good morning! Today is January 6th, 2023. Almost said 2022. Today is the day I leave for my fourth contract. But this time we are doing a contract on land. So this is gonna be a whole new experience. Hopefully you can hear me, I'm running the dishwasher. Um, my parents were out of town the last two days, so I have to take care of the house while they're gone. But yeah, I am flying to Florida today and I will be working in Florida for like three and a half weeks. So short, but very sweet. I'm really looking forward to the experience. I honestly have no clue what to expect, so. I guess we'll find out. It's like quarter to eight now. I woke up at seven and kind of laid in bed till around 7.15. My flight's at 11.45. Buffalo Airport isn't that big, so you don't really need a ton of time. I'm really hoping for a smooth travel day. That doesn't seem to be my luck whenever I'm traveling to or from a contract, but hopefully this time is different. And I've got a cup of coffee to start the day. But cheers, guys. Let's, let's have a good travel day. It is time! It really breaks my heart every time I have to pack because Coco just knows what's coming. Look at her. Hi, baby. I'm just gonna hope that I have everything I need. And worst comes to worst, I'll just buy something if I've forgotten anything. But like, I'm pretty sure I have way more than I need, you know? so bougie when I'm traveling with these. <laughs> okay, we're ready to go. Just waiting for my uncle to arrive. Here's my outport fit. I'm just wearing my jeans because it's easier than putting them in my luggage because they're heavy and they're really comfortable. I've got my sneakers on, my vest, my jacket, and a tank top underneath because I do get quite hot in the airport, but on the plane I'm always freezing. So I'm gonna want this for rehearsals. I mean, it doesn't go the best together, but It'll do. <laughs> Goodbye room, see you in a couple weeks. <laughs> I'm gonna miss this bed for sure. Even leaving for just a couple weeks, it's so hard to leave her behind. Say bye baby, see you in a couple weeks. I am through security. It went so smooth, so simple. I dropped my bag off, I think it was 33 pounds. And then yeah, security was so easy. I left everything in my bag. I told them I had skates and it was not a problem. I had my TSA little screenshot ready just in case, but no problems there. And now I have about two hours to sit and wait for my flight. So we're gonna board at 11. So I'm gonna sit here, edit emails, and then should be on our way soon. Thank you. JetBlue welcomes you to John S. Kennedy. The local time is 1.01 p.m. I have landed in JFK and I'm just grabbing a bite to eat, but this airport is so expensive, so I just got a yogurt and a banana, and then I'm gonna get a Dunkin' coffee because do I have to explain myself? Like I said, I made it to JFK. Um, it's currently 1.40. Figuring out what I was gonna eat and paying for it and then getting coffee. It was a whole process. My next flight takes off at three. Contrary to how this looks, it tastes good, so that's what matters. I'm quite hungry, but I didn't want to pay like 
$50 for lunch here. I got a Chobani peach Greek yogurt, a banana, and a protein bar. It's the Nugo Dark. I used to love these. Like, I used to eat them all the time. I think we just stopped buying them. So that is my lunch. I think it'll fill me up enough until I arrive to Florida and then I can have a dinner there. And I didn't want to feel gross and eat something greasy. So this was this was our best bet. This in total cost me $10 and then the coffee was like $5. So $15 isn't too bad, you know? We're not delayed, but we haven't boarded yet. We were supposed to start boarding like 30 minutes ago. So I guess they're still cleaning the plane. But it's like 2.50 and we're supposed to take off at three, so. I have officially landed. Now I just have to pick up my bag. I really, really, really hope that it made it here. And then we should be headed to the hotel. Thank God. <laughs> checked into the hotel, somewhat settled in, and now I'm at Whole Foods with my roommate. I'm just gonna pick up some stuff for the room, like snacky things, and naturally I'm in the wine section. I don't know what I want, if I wanna get white or red, probably white. <laughs> So nice, there's like a pool right in the middle. Here's just a quick overview. I can go more in depth tomorrow. So basically how we decided was that this half is Amy's section. And then this table, I put my stuff on. I mean, I don't have that much stuff. My shoes are here. And then I've tucked away my luggage in there. And then this is my bed. And of course I brought my pillowcase. This is a setup. I am so, I'm so happy to be settled in. This place is really nice and I am exhausted. It's been a very long day, but I am very happy that it was a relatively smooth travel day as opposed to some of my other travel days. We don't start rehearsals until two o'clock tomorrow. So I have the morning to myself. So yeah, I'm going to end up the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the travel day traveling with me and um, I will see you tomorrow for the first day of rehearsals.